Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. In this video, we are going to have a look on top 10 engineering colleges of Karnataka. Before starting, if you have not subscribed to our channel, then click on the subscribe button and press the bell icon for proper notifications of our videos related to college reviews, college comparisons, courses and much more. So let's get started. At number 10, Jain University is placed. It was established in 1990. Jain University is a higher education institute located in Bangalore, India. Origination from Sri Bhagwan Mahabir Jain College, it was conferred the deemed to be university status in 2009. It has a student intake of 1,380 for UG courses. The campus size is around 300 acres. Number of students who graduated last year were 378, out of which 130 59 students got placed and 78 students were selected for higher studies. Median salary is 3,20,000. Admission to this college is done through JET examination and the minimum qualification required to appear in JET examination is to get passed in 10 plus 2 examination. Overall, it has an NIRF rank of 117. New Horizon College of Engineering is placed at number 9. It was established in 2001. New Horizon College of Engineering is an autonomous college permanently affiliated to Visveshwarao Technological University, approved by the All India Council for Technical Education and University Grants Commission. It is accredited by NAAC with A grade and NBA. It has a student intake of 1080 for UG courses. The campus size is around 11 acres. Number of students who graduated last year were 1091, out of which 927 students got placed and 105 students were selected for higher studies. The median salary is 651,000. KCET and Comet K exam is considered for admission in New Horizon College of Engineering. To get admission in New Horizon College of Engineering, the minimum qualification criteria is to get passed in 10 plus 2 examination and at least secure 45% marks in the main subjects that is PCM or PCB. Overall, it has an NIRF rank of 114. PES University is placed at number 8. It was established in 1972 at Bangalore, India. The private university comprises four campuses. The residential facilities are planned as per international standards and the hostels comprise well-ventilated rooms and modern cafeteria. The university provides a perfect blend of contemporary education and industry exposure. It has a student intake of 1,440 for UG courses. It has a campus size of 25 acres. Number of students who graduated last year were 936 out of which 605 students got placed and 120 students were selected for higher education. The median salary is 6,50,000. KCET and PESSAT exam is considered for admission in PES University for BTAC courses. The minimum qualification criteria to get admission in this college is to secure 45% marks in 10 plus 2 examinations. Overall, it has a NIRF rank of 93. Siddhaganga Institute of Technology is placed at number 7. It was established in 1963. Siddhaganga Institute of Technology is a technological institute in Tumkur, Karnataka, India. It is run by the Sri Siddhaganga Educational Society. It offers undergraduate degree courses in 12 disciplines. It became an autonomous institution under Visveshwarao Technological University in 2007-8 with the last VTU batch graduating in 2010. It has a student intake of 870 for UG courses. It has a campus size of 65 acres. Number of students who graduated last year were 806, out of which 741 students got placed and 52 students were selected for higher studies. It has a median salary of 4,50,000. KCET and Comet K examination is considered for admission in Siddhaganga Institute of Technology for BE BTEC courses. To get admission in Siddhaganga Institute of Technology, the minimum requirement is to get passed in 10 plus 2 examination and at least secure 45% marks in the main subjects that is PCM or PCB. Overall, it has a NIRF rank of 91. 
BMS College of Engineering is placed at number 6. It was established in 1946. BMS College of Engineering is an autonomous engineering college in Basavangudi, Bengaluru, India. It is affiliated with Visveserao Technological University and became autonomous in 2008. Though a private engineering college, but it is partially funded by the government of Karnataka. It has a student intake of 1,405 for UG courses. The campus size is around 15 acres. Number of students who graduated last year were 1,019, out of which 571 students got placed and 137 students were selected for higher studies. The median salary is 7 lakh. KCET and Comedic examination is considered for admission in BMS College of Engineering for BE courses. The minimum requirement to get admission in BMS College of Engineering is to get passed in 10 plus 2 examination and at least secure 45% marks in your main subjects that is PCM or PCB. Overall, it has a NIRF rank of 73. RV College of Engineering is placed at number 5. It was established in 1963. RV College of Engineering is a private technical co-educational college located in Bangalore, Karnataka, India. It is affiliated to the Visvesara Technological University, Belgaum. RVC is accredited by the All India Council for Technical Education and all its departments are accredited by the National Board of Accreditation. It has a student intake of 1060. It has a campus size of around 56 acres. Number of students who graduated last year were 950, out of which 794 students got placed and 59 students were selected for higher studies. The median salary is 8 lakh. KCET, J-Main and Comed-K examination is considered for admission in RV College of Engineering for UG courses. The minimum requirement to get admission in RVC is to get passed in 10 plus 2 examination and at least secure 45% marks in your main subjects that is PCM or PCB. Overall, RV College of Engineering has a NIRF rank of 70. Triple IT Bangalore is placed at number 4. It was established in 1999. The International Institute of Information Technology Bangalore is a technical and research university in Bangalore, India. The institute is a registered not-for-profit society funded jointly by the government of Karnataka and the IT industry under a public-private partnership model. Triple IT Bangalore is managed by a government body with Chris Gopala Krishnan, co-founder of Infosys Limited, as the chairperson. It has a student intake of 120 for the PG integrated courses of 5 years. It has a campus size of 9 acres. Number of students who graduated through integrated programs were 60, out of which 50 students got placed and 9 students were selected for higher studies. The median salary is 18,50,000. J mains exam is considered for admission in Triple IT Bangalore for integrated 5 year courses. The minimum requirement to get admission in International Institute of Information Technology Bangalore is to secure at least 60% marks in 10 plus 2 examination. Overall, it has a NIRF rank of 62. MS Ramayya Institute of Technology is placed at number 3. It was established in 1962. Ramayya Institute of Technology is an autonomous private engineering college located in Bangalore, Karnataka. The college is affiliated to Visveserao Technological University. While VTU still awards the degrees, the college has academic freedom in framing its own schemes of study, curricula and student evaluation. RIT is also a research center in 12 areas including engineering and management disciplines. It has a student intake of 1080 for UG courses. The campus size is around 25 acres. Number of students who graduated last year were 1137 out of which 847 were placed and 189 students were selected for higher studies. The median salary is 5,20,000. Comed K and KCT exam is considered for admission in MS Ramayya Institute of Technology for BE BTech courses. The minimum requirement to get admission in Ramayya Institute of Technology is to get passed in 10 plus 2 examination and at least secure 45% marks in PCM or PCB. Overall, it has an NIRF rank of 59. 
Manipal Institute of Technology is placed at number 2. It was established in 1957. Manipal Institute of Technology is a constituent institution of Manipal Academy of Higher Education that specializes in engineering. MIT contains 17 academic departments. It is one of the first self-financed colleges in India. It has a student intake of 1,860 for UG courses. It has a campus size of around 188 acres. Number of students who graduated last year were 1,742, out of which 927 students got placed and 186 students were selected for higher studies. The median salary offered is 6,20,000. MET exam is considered for Manipal Institute of Technology for admission in BTEC courses. The minimum requirements to get admission in Manipal Institute of Technology is to secure at least 60% marks in 10 plus 2 examination. Overall, it has an NIRF rank of 45. NIT Karnataka is placed at number 1. It was established in 1960. National Institute of Technology Karnataka, also known as NIT Suratkal, is a public engineering university at Suratkal, Mangaluru. It was founded as Karnataka Regional Engineering College, while today it is one of the 32 NITs in India and is recognized as an institute of national importance by the government of India. It has a suburban campus in close proximity to the Arabian Sea and H66 runs through the campus and serves as the major mode of access. It has a student intake of 890 for the UG courses and has a campus size of 100 acres. Number of students who graduated last year were 788 out of which 692 students got placed and 92 students were selected for higher studies. The median salary offered is 8 lakh. Jamie's exam is considered for admission in NIT Karnataka for BTEC courses. The minimum requirement to get admission in NIT Karnataka is to secure at least 75% marks in 10 plus 2 examination. Overall, it has an NIRF rank of 13. If you have enjoyed the video, then click on the like and subscribe button and press the bell icon for proper notifications of more such videos from our channel.